Hi, everybody. This is Lex at MaxFuture.com, and I want to talk to you about an upgrade to version 2.0 of a very cool app for the iPad called Haiku Deck. And this is a really cool app for creating, um, you know, slideshows like PowerPoint or Keynote uh, slideshows. But this is kind of innovative because it makes it really easy to create great, you know, PowerPoints or slideshows without having to do much. And it was recently updated to add things like the ability to create charts and bullets and numbers lists and, um, you know, all sorts of additions um, like um, cropping and editing is better and the ability to share with your website or other services and also the export and use with, um, with um, you know, PowerPoint or Keynote. But let me just show you how it works. Uh, now it's free. Uh, but the way they make money is they sell you additional themes for $1.99, uh, I guess like 10 of them, but you can uh, buy all the themes for $14.99. So you get a discount if you buy all, all 10 themes uh, for $15. So let me just show you how it works. It looks, it's, this is a very cool program, and I think, uh, you know, I think it's really great. So let me, let me show you how it works. Okay, so this is what it looks like when you first launch Haiku Deck. Uh, I guess you use it uh, horizontally like this, and basically it comes with a um, it comes with a, um, a sort of a sample a sample um, video that you can sort of um, you know check out if you want to see how to use it. But basically, it's a PowerPoint uh, creator. So let's go back to the main menu. Um, and you can um, sign in, and if you sign in, you can do more things uh, like share it to sites and stuff like that. So let's just create a new um, let's just create a new um, PowerPoint or a, a presentation. So you just press the plus sign there. And here's the cool thing: we're gonna we're gonna just do a slideshow. Let's say I say happiness. Okay, happiness is. All right, and so I have that. So I've got this nice slide. Happiness is, and I'm going to use a theme. Um, well, that's the name of the um, the pr uh, presentation. It's called Happiness. But now for the sl slide, I'm going to put some text in here. Happiness is. All right, so that's what I want to talk about, and. Um, so I can put text now on the left you can see I can add some like background picture and what they do is they have I guess all these creative commons licensed photos that you can use if you're not using them I guess commercially so um, and and it automatically can see the text that I put in there happiness is so it's look, looking for images that sort of match up with happiness so I'm just gonna like scroll here through here and look for stuff that is like happy, happiness. Um, um, well, this woman with the clown's face here. So I'm gonna press that, and then boom, that's the background for my that slide. Happiness is. And uh, let's see, I'm gonna create another slide, and I'm gonna go. Um, um, happiness is. Um, um, playing games. Misspelled that. Playing games. Okay, there we go. Playing games. And then I'm going to add some games um, with your friends. I'm going to say with your friends. And I'm going to go back to the pictures. And let's see. Um, I can pick the word games. It, it's automatically figured out like the words in my slide. So I'm going to scroll through here and look for something that is matching up with, uh, with games. Let's see. Um, games. Happiness. And then you got like um, games. Well, some of them are. Here's one. Uh, kids playing soccer. So I'm going to select that and I'm going to go done and then I have that. So I have like two slides here. Happiness is 
playing games. Now, the other cool thing is you can add things like charts. So um, I am going to say um, how happy are people? How happy are people? Misspelled P-E-O-P-L-E. And I'm going to go return. And I'm going to go back up to the pictures. And now, happy people. I've got pictures, but I can select a chart. And um, so I can do like a bar chart. And I'm going to press d done. And I'm going to have a chart. How happy are people? And I can edit the labels yesterday. And then the next bar chart, I'm going to say today. And I can edit the units. Um, maximum value, save. And then... Um, Let's see, I can um, raise it like that and say people are happier. How happy are people? And um, let's see, I wonder if I can put a photo in there too. Uh, no. No, I don't want to do that. Let's go back. There's n I don't know if there's an easy way to do a... Oh. Back. Oh, it stayed there yesterday, today. So it stayed there. So, and then if I want to play it, well, let's see if we can start. It, it has animation with this theme. So let me actually go back to the happiness is. I'm going to play it and. I could just hold this up at a, I don't know, at a, um, a meeting, see? And there is like a little bit of animation, playing games with your friends. How happy are people? And you can just keep adding this. So the cool thing is it's just a quick way to find great photos to go with your um, slide, but also has nice animation and... Um, you can change the themes like let's see let's see if I can change the themes edit I'm gonna go back to edit and see all these themes at the top are free and you can press that button there you go I'm gonna go five seven pick square cinematic zisu now if you want more than these I guess they give you one two three four five you can pay for them two dollars like I said so let's see like what Zisu looks like um, happiness is hmm, I don't know if it's that different let's um, edit it again go to the themes let's try picks Uh, pick air square and then try that it's a little different um, anyways look it's a cool app because if you want to play with it more and export it to PowerPoint you can do it you can do it by emailing once you sign up for an account and you can use I guess Twitter or Facebook to sign up uh, you can embed it in your website and you can, um, um, you know, you can share it in a number of ways. Let's see, if you press the share button, you can make it pr public, you can make it private, you can make it restricted, you can set a category, um, you know, business, education. You can actually um, share it on the Haiku Deck website for other people to use and see other people's um, haiku decks and if you open the gallery you can uh, see other other um, 
you know, other haiku decks that people have done. So I think it's very cool. I think it's very innovative. And I could see using this to create presentations either for my website or for other purposes. So check it out. It's called Haiku Deck. Bye.